Well, I certainly did not want to make this video or accept this fact, but I think we all knew, like, we all knew a long time ago the current state of Modern Warfare 2. We all know that, like, what has become of it happened a long time ago, long before this video, but no one likes to watch their nostalgia just die. So, like, I held on to, like, a sliver, like a finite, itty-bitty sliver of hope that maybe, just maybe, I could salvage something from this game, but... No, um, it's been ruined by hackers, modders, whatever the fuck you want to call them. But I will say it is hilarious to look at them. They're like some foreign creature at a zoo, which is like, ooh, look at that. You don't see that every day. Um, what the fuck is it doing? So, like, it just ruins the game. And I'm just going to skip over to <laughs> just Modern Warfare 3 footage. I, I can't. I can't deal with this. Like, seeing a, a beloved game just ruined by just people, like, these aren't even, like, the nice hackers, which, like, give XP lobbies to random people. Like, these guys just are in it for themselves. Like, there's nothing, there's no, nothing to be, like, redeemed here. Like, they just ruined the game. So, unfortunately, I think I'm just going to have to skip Modern Warfare 2. Like, all the Modern Warfare experience is just going to be all Modern Warfare 3, because, I mean, it's not every single game, like, they don't always show up, but, like, when they do, it's just a huge buzzkill, like, surprisingly, TDM is pretty sparse on hackers, but when they do show up, it's just a huge buzzkill to the experience, like, if they're on your team, like, you're gonna win, it doesn't fucking matter, like, they're gonna get everyone killed, or everyone's gonna leave on the other team, or they're gonna get their streaks and kill everyone anyways, like, it just doesn't matter, so, like, when they're on your team, like, victory is meaningless, and when you're against them, you have no chance, so, like, the whole thing is just a waste of time, so, ah, thanks, modder hackers, whatever the fuck you are, I don't know, so, just thanks for that, like, you just ruined a, an amazing game, which, you know, a lot of us have, like, very good memories of, so, thanks for that, but, yeah, so, unfortunately, it's just gonna be Modern Warfare 3, and I find that, like, so dumb, it's like, these people, like, they're so selfish that, like, they have to take away the experience for those of us that were there to play those older Call of Duties and just, you know, want to relive a little bit of it, but we can't because they come in and just ruin the game for not only us, but, like, the other people in the lobby, so it's like, that's really the dumbest thing ever, it's like, way to really ruin the fun, like, you are the epitome of ruining the fun, so thanks a lot for that. So, it just really sucks because, like, I'm confined to playing BO2, Modern Warfare 3, and a little bit of BO1. There are people using mods there, but it's mostly just doing that XP lobby bullshit or whatever it is that gives you, like, max level and tons of money and stuff like that. But that's really it. But still, it's like, that cuts off so many Call of Duties, like World at War, COD 4, Modern Warfare 2. Like, that's, a, that's half of them right there. So, like, I can't really touch those because the fun's just ruined by these people. You know, it's... Oh, man, it's whatever. It was probably bound to happen anyways, but it just sucks, like, to really see it up front again. You know, just seeing it like, okay, it really is dead, and there's nothing you can do about it. So, that sucks, but, um, I guess it's just Modern Warfare 3, so hopefully that's not a problem for you guys. But, uh, yeah, so hopefully you guys enjoyed the, um, gameplay in the background. Not even, uh, not even a majority of it is Modern Warfare 2, just because I was so tired of hackers. And just, man, I couldn't fully enjoy myself in the games, but... Yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed the Modern Warfare 3 footage. Hopefully that's a little bit better, but yeah, so um, Modern Warfare 2 is definitely off the list. I'll, I'm, I'm going to keep trying for COD 4, but um, it's it's not much better. And uh, World at War, eh, I'll let you guys uh, imagine how bad that is. And um, BO1, I'm still trying. I'll see how that turns out. But yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching the video. And like always, have an awesome day. I'll see you all in the next one.